subscribe to our youtube channel and press the bell icon to get the latest updates hello viewers welcome to the fast profits daily myself brijesh bhatia as you have read the uh, title pharma sector from an underdog to dark horse well if you remember in the uh, yesterday's video i have indicated that the pharma index to nifty 50 chart has been uh, showing a sign of reversal let's revisit that chart again uh, if you look remember uh, this was the chart which i have discussed in yesterday's video where it is forming the bullish uh, gartley and uh, bullish gartley is basically the harmonic pattern uh, the reverse it is reversal in nature calculated based on various fibonacci numbers and if you look at the last uh, five six weeks of uh, momentum it is showing a sign of uh, a positive uh, trajectory and even if you remember uh, if you look at the uh, stocks like sun pharma stocks like sipla which is are trading at 52 week highs uh, even the stock like auto pharma dv slab in the last few weeks have come back very very strongly uh, laura slab is the one stock which has come very very strongly so there are few stocks uh, which are trading at 52 week high which are showing the sign of positive momentum and that have resulted uh, pharma index art performance against the nifty now with this bullish uh, harmonic uh, called the bullish cutly uh, there is an bullish uh, crossover on MACD as well if you look at the lower panel over here and this uh, bullish crossover has happened right after 2020 uh, if you look at the uh, previous uh, crossover happened in 2020 where the rally was uh, very much higher and pharma index was one of the most outperforming sector in 2020 again on the back of uh, pandemic uh, the uh, there is a sign that uh, pharma uh, is uh, one of the outperformer and it's been a uh, perception uh, that it could continue in 2021 but it didn't happen and 2021 it underperformed uh, against the other indices now back in 2022 uh, we are looking at the uh, momentum of our performance against the nifty for pharma index look at let's look at the uh, weekly chart over here of uh, the pharma index uh, again if you look at 2020 uh, uh, september highs been you're not yet taken out but if you look at uh, the uh, two three weeks back we have seen bullish uh, engulfing forming uh, on to the weekly chart plus uh, the MACD if you look at on the lower panel again uh, 2000 March 2020 uh, MACD uh, bullish crossover into the oversold uh, uh, region uh, now again uh, after the uh, two years we are witnessing bullish crossover on weekly MACD uh, right at bullish uh, engulfing uh, with the bullish MACD positive crossover it indicates that something is cooking into the pharma space and it's uh, a sign of a bullish momentum look at the top down approach and let's go on to the daily chart over here okay uh, if you look at the daily chart over here though we saw a death cross uh, right in December 2021 uh, November December 2021 so death cross is basically when your short term averages crosses below the uh, long term averages so here the blue line which is 50 days average crossing below the orange line which is 200 days average and it is a sign of death cross uh, indicate that uh, the stock or the sector which the chart which you are using is uh, underperforming or is in a bearish trend but if you look at the recent momentum uh, it's back above 50 days average but still below the 200 days average which is rightly placed around 13,900 levels and uh, if you look at this black line the falling trend line resistance is somewhere around 13800 uh, levels so i believe once this resistance is taken out convincingly uh, prices head above the 200 is average at 13900 and psychological psychological level of 14000 uh, if this 13800 14000 level is taken out for the pharma space i think it will be in a sweet spot uh, for an investor for a trader and we might see uh, one of the uh, strong outperformer for next quarter april may june uh, the pharma index could be one of the leader into the uh, next quarter and you should not miss this uh, rally uh, once again i repeat once the level of 14000 is taken out into the pharma space look for a bullish opportunity where the stocks are rising again as i said sun pharma sipla is trading at 52 week highs or pharma is coming back divis lab is coming back lawrence lab is coming back very very strongly so these are the few stocks you can keep an eye on and as we are into the result season from april uh, may uh, we might see in case uh, something positive triggers for these companies uh, we might see a huge rally coming into the uh, pharma space so 
keep a watch which has been under rock for last one uh, more than one one and uh, 12 to 15 months might be a game changer and dark horse for next uh, one to two quarters and pharma is the one sector i think can uh, uh, turn from underdog to the dark horse so keep a watch on the pharma space uh, above 14000 levels uh, looking for a huge uh, upside momentum once the 14000 levels is crossed signing off bridge batia